Welcome to Summer in Sydney. From Manly to Bondi, there are a million different options when it comes to beaches. And every local here will tell you someplace different. So let me break it down and show you five great locations to check out while you're here in the city. Come on. This is the land of sky blue waters. Let's begin the list on the south side of Sydney's incredible coastal walk with a set of local favorites. First, there's Bronte Beach, a family-friendly spot where natural and man-made pools protect you from the dangerous rip known as the Bronte Express. And over Dolphins Point, there's Coogee Beach, which, along with being really fun to say, it's a much larger beach than Bronte and also safer for swimming. In between Coogee and Bronte is the concrete and rocky waterfront of Clovelly Beach. It's the perfect place to go if you don't want that sand in your bikini. And from there, a two minute walk across Boondock Park is Gordon's Bay, which doesn't have the best beach, but the water is calm and clear, so it's a really nice spot for snorkeling. Coming in at number four-ish on the list is the smaller bay beaches towards the top end of the peninsula. And my personal favorite of these is a cool little hidden gem called Parsley Bay, which is tucked away within a quiet neighborhood, and the shark nets make me feel a little better about swimming. A few other choice spots over here are Cuddy Beach, Watson's Bay, and Milk Beach, which has an amazing view of the city. Back on the beautiful coastline, the quiet and secluded Tamarama Beach is a great place to get away from the crowds of neighboring Kuji and Bondi. And it's usually occupied by a laid back local crowd with a heavy focus on the top notch surf break. Just around the rocky cliffs, you'll find one of the most well known beaches in the world. From the iconic icebergs pool, which overlooks the beach, to the abundance of beautiful sunbathers, Bondi is famous for a reason. Popular with international backpackers and tourists, it's a place to see and be seen, especially considering it's bikini top optional. Don't get too distracted though, because there's a ton of beach activities going on and the waves are a bit more manageable than at other locations, so it's a good place to take that first surf lesson or just go for a swim. And my number one selection for best beaches in Sydney is actually more of an area than it is one beach in particular. If you take the ferry north from Sydney Harbour, you'll come to Manly Beach. And this is the gateway to the most beautiful stretch of sand in all of Sydney. Manly itself is the most lively of all the northern beaches. With surf competitions and weekend events, it's a very popular place in the summertime. But if you're looking for a break from the crowds, keep heading north and you'll find a lot more space in the sand. You got places like Calaroy, Avalon, and way up at the top is the beautiful Palm Beach. And if you made it this far, you've officially explored some of the best beaches in Sydney. And that merits a celebratory drink back in Manly. Because as you can see, there are a ton of beaches to choose from in the city. And you really can't go wrong with any of them. It just depends on your preference. Now let's all watch the debate begin in the comments. <laughs> the best thing about Manly is? It's the, it's the surfer dudes. Yeah. yeah. I agree with that. <laughs> and the beach. And the view. And the drinks. The weather. Everything <laughs> is. Everything is just. And the people here. Yeah. 